How we doing everyone? Sammy and I People's TV. I, I'm not here to celebrate United winning a football game. But I am here to celebrate Liverpool not winning the fucking treble. I apologise about the loudness. The fact that I'm drunk, I'll be honest. Look, it's nice you come to eat. if you can get if you can do hospitality, you do it once in a while. I've done it once in a while, but today is not a time where we're gonna talk about how good Manchester United were. It's a day where we're gonna talk about how we managed to avoid the apocalypse. And that's it. That's all you need to talk about. It's gonna be an extremely short match reaction. Simply for that. It's the end of the season. Eric Ten Hag was in attendance at Selhurst Park and uh, I tried to get I was like, look, let me try and find Eric Ten Hag. I'll get a picture with him. I'll, you know, I'll speak to him. No, I didn't see him at all. And it's not a surprise. But, wow. Uh, I think City were losing, what, 2-0? And we all thought the worst. And, that, and that's what it's come to, right? That is what Manchester United Football Club has come to. That we've got to sit here and, and, and celebrate Liverpool... And, and, and celebrate Liverpool not winning and celebrate City coming from 2-0 down to win a game 3-2. That's how bad things are at the club at the moment. It feels like we've reached like a, like an old, like a, like a new low, uh, like an average low, but I hope that whatever comes next, uh, the boys are coming back outside here, trying to get my match reaction. But look, let's try and end it now, eh? Liverpool didn't do the treble. It's about time that people start putting a bit of credit on that treble. It's a chance that survived since 99 and we're in 2022 right now and still nobody can talk about it, all right? That's the end of this season. It's a very short match review. Bring on next year and bring on Ten Hag. End the conversation.